Welcome. Today I'm here with my friend Niasso and we want to talk about astrology and evolutionary astrology. Hey Shakti. I'm really excited because I want to learn more about astrology. I'm kind of a beginner and especially the term evolutionary biology. Evolution, evolutionary Mary astrology. Astrology, I, I've actually not heard. Uh -huh. So yeah. I'd love to know what that is. Okay. So first of all, astrology is a system which works with archetypes and symbols. And those are describing kind of the underlying creative principles of the universe. And uh, whenever we look at a chart of somebody, there are all the planets inside the zodiac and the planets are in different signs and in different houses. So we get very specific information about all these planets and what they're symbolizing for us. Like uh, we could look at those planets, those creative forming principles as inner parts in us. Like mm -hmm. we all have an inner man symbolized by Sun and Mars. We all have an inner woman symbolized by Moon and Venus and then we have Mercury for our voice and all these other parts. So we can look at the chart through that perspective so that all those planets represent inner aspects or inner actors. And is that why then people have astrology readings? Is it because they learn about their life? Yeah, what you can get out of an astrological reading is like you get a deep reflection about who you are in your whole potential and who you are, how all those inner parts are designed and what your map is and your, your blueprint in this mm -hmm. life. Mm -hmm. So the more uh, usual astrology uh, works often with a psychodynamic dimension of a chart. So we would discuss uh, who you are, what your potential is, where your challenges are and how you could approach them in a better way, which is very effective and very helpful for people. In evolutionary astrology, we go one step further. We not only look at who you are, because I mean, I start out that way and then you kind of will not, and yes, this is who I know myself to be, but we will then talk about why you are that person coming into this lifetime with these challenges. And evolutionary astrology is kind of looking at your horoscope, your individual chart, from the perspective of your soul's journey. So mm -hmm. we can look at everything in the chart from the perspective, what do you really need to learn this lifetime? What do you need to heal? What trauma are you carrying? So mm -hmm. with evolutionary astrology, we really talk about what's your karmic destiny this lifetime, this time around. Mm -hmm. uh, I did have one of those readings with you some mm -hmm. weeks ago, mm -hmm. and I do say that it was tremendously helpful mm -hmm. because it kind of made me realize that, oh, okay, there's a bigger picture mm -hmm. and I can refer to it. Mm -hmm. And it was also very deeply touching because it made me go, oh my God, that is why I am that is what this is. So I've already experienced it firsthand one time, mm -hmm. just what what it does. Yes, yes. So um, so this is really the deep, the deeper potential with evolutionary astrology that it gives you the why, and it gives you the higher perspective of where you really need and want to go this lifetime. Mm -hmm.